Hastings left Salt Lake City. We tracked his movements all the way to Cuba. We have to assume Perseus moved the nuke there. Langley believes Castro could help Perseus smuggle it into the U.S. in exchange for a peek at the hardware, of course. That isn't gonna happen. What's the plan? The last read we have on Hastings came from 30 miles south of Havana. We suspect Perseus is using an abandoned compound there to hold the nuke. They're working under the radar, so expect moderate security. I say we smash and grab. Parachute in, grab the nuke, skyhook out. And what if the nuke isn't there? It's there. The only reason Perseus needs Hastings in Cuba is to prepare it for arming and detonation. There you have it. Hudson will arrange our exfil while we're en route. If everyone's ready, let's move out. Adler's late. No, love, we're early. Adler should be checking in right about... Mark, we're in position. Copy that. We're moving to flank. All teams, we do this fast and loud. Find Hastings, grab the nuke, get the hell out. Woods, light up this joint. About fucking time. Go, go, go! Do the honors, Bill. Morning act. Like fucking clockwork. Hey, All teams pan out. Best to the main gate. Let's 
Mark, take your team right. Copy. What did these poor bastards do? They finished their job. They love a reward. They've got closed circuit cameras. We could use them to locate the nuclear bomb. Sharp as ever, Park. Shop. Contact. Fuck. Is everyone all right? Bell, sweep for mines. Bomb defused. Ambush! Cover me! Lovely. This will come in handy. Get on the camera feeds, Bell. Bell, scan the camera feeds. Mason, you missed one behind the counter. Thanks, Park. Keep looking. There. Hold it. Adler, we have eyes on the nuclear device. Bloody hell. Someone's killing the scientists. Where? Second floor, room 27B. Second floor, center room. Upstairs. Let's Whoa. move. Get you there, Park. Crude, but effective. Can't keep your eyes off me, huh, Park? Bell, use the C4. Adler, we're moving to the second floor. We're pinned down. Move ahead. We'll catch up.
¡Necesito cobertura! We're heading inside. Lazar, man the door. Got it, Marsh. Bell canvas the room. Hastings, stop talking. <laughs> Perseus was here. <coughs> he shot us. He escaped. Perseus would never leave his precious nuke behind. He forced us to reverse engineer the detonation codes. They'd give him full access to green light. What? Are you telling me Perseus can detonate multiple nukes in Europe? I'm so... sorry. Hastings, stay with us. How many green light devices can Perseus detonate with those codes? He can detonate... all of them. He'll wipe out half of Europe. And blame it all on the USA. We need to find that son of a bitch, Perseus. Time to go. I'm no moving. contact. Chopper coming in low. Gotta be Perseus. All teams head to the roof. Adler, we got a shit ton of reinforcements circling this compound.
I need cover. Bell, the window. Go. Fuck me. The chopper got away. Fuck Perseus. We got bigger problems. Look down. Don't wait for us. This is ground team. I'm bringing you our visual. Roger that, ground team. We have visual. Fasten your harness. Cross your arms. And remember to keep your backs to the wind. Inbound in two minutes. Go in with the intel you have, not the intel you want. We paid the fucking piper down there. You think this is Bell's fault? I don't know whose fault it is. I just know that Perseus doesn't have a single fucking nuke. He's got dozens. Millions of people are gonna die, and the United States will take the blame. You need to find out where he's planning to broadcast the activation signal. How are we gonna pull that out of our ass? Bell knows where it is. Bell? This goddamn science project was a failure! Don't count Adler out yet. The man has a deep bag of tricks. Come on, just a little further.
Sims, get the gurney. Like I owe you. Ah. Bloody hell. We're going to lose a lot more than Lazar if we don't execute this next move correctly. We need you to hang in there for one more assignment. I'm counting on you again, Bell. Sims, get the dosages ready. All of them. Adler, stop wasting our valuable time. He's of no use to us anymore. Stay alert, Bell. You're the key to stopping persons. You always have been. No more half-assing it. We're doing an intracerebral injection. Injecting directly into the brain could provoke seizures, or worse. Damn. Do the eye socket. You sure about this, Doc? Memory should begin almost immediately. Bell, listen to me. I need you to remember. Think back to our time in Vietnam one more time. We need to finish what we started. We had a job to do. Think, Bell. Perseus. Do you remember coming face to face with Perseus in Vietnam? EKG is spiking. Shit. Heart rate's off the charts. I need you to relax and focus, Bell. Your helicopter crashed. You made your way through the jungle, alone. You found a bunker. Do you remember the bunker, Bell? We need to know what's inside that bunker. Do not trust Adler. Adler is lying to you. Do not trust him. Do not listen to Adler. He is lying to you. He is lying to you. Do not trust Adler. During a mission to investigate reports of a Soviet bunker, your chopper was hit by ground fire. According to your debrief, you woke up in the middle of a firefight. Crash survivors were defending against a VC attack. You ran forward and picked up an M16. Or maybe it was another weapon. Then you realized you were the sole survivor. You set off to locate the bunker.
The path split near a ruin, so he took the right fork, not the trail to the left. The zip line nearby was the best way back to the cave. We wanted to get to that bunker as soon as possible. Bell, turn back and use the zip line to reach the bunker. Seeing a firefight, you readied your M16. I stood up a hornet's nest. You need chopper support ASAP. Roger that. Chopper inbound. ETA two minutes. Yes, this was the bunker entrance you described in the report. Christ, what's happening to him? A mild seizure. Sims, can you hand me the benzodiazepine?
Let's up the dosage and run 1B this time. Okay, ready. According to your debrief, you woke up and the rest of your crew was missing. The VC were on the ground searching for survivors. You readied your bow to take them out silently. You never mentioned the house in your debrief. Time to move along. path split near a ruin, so he took the right fork, not the trail to the left. The zip line nearby was the best way back to the cage. You wanted to get to that bunker as soon as possible.
Turn back and use the zip line to reach the bunker. Bell keeps switching scenarios. Now he's running 11. You allies were pinned down on a ridge. You readied your sniper rifle to assist. Command says we need to clear that house. Command, this is Big Duke 4. We've got a possible Soviet command outpost in sight. It's BC all over us. Requesting a napalm strike. Where are they all coming from? Big Duke 4, Roger. Diverting air power to your area, 30 seconds out. Administering one cc of adrenaline. That's it, Bell. That's what you were looking for. Perseus was in there. Running scenario one. Bell, we've got a job to do. I wouldn't advise that. 
I didn't ask. According to your debrief, you woke up in the middle of a firefight. Crash survivors were defending against a VC attack. You readied a grenade launcher and charged it. Path split near a ruin, so he took the right fork, not the trail to the left. Thanks for the assist. You heard Russian voices from a cave across the river, so you went to investigate. Bell, I need you to turn around and go into the cave. Take the zip line down to the river. Bell, go back to the zip line. The bunker is in the caves. Go!
found the bunker by going into the cave. Why is... Sims, this is scenario 17. Pulled out your sidearm and flashlight. Stop lying, Bell. Start again and tell me how you met Perseus. I don't care if the door was fucking stuck. Open it. Give Bell another injection. That could be lethal. Bell's heart rate is going Do it up. now! Heart rate is spiking. I'm not sure how much longer Bell can last.
Stop wasting my time with this hallway. Turn around. What the lab? What the hell is Bell doing in the lab? Forget about the damn lab. I need to know about the bunker. We're losing Bell. We're completely off script. Bell's been through a lot of trauma, both real and imagined. We have no leads left. We'll push until we get what we need, or Bell dies. Seventeen. Ready. Bell, we've got a job to do. We've been over this already. Skip ahead to the next one. The bunker door was right there at the ruins, Bell. You went in. Bell, go into the bunker now. Bell, open the door. Tell me about Perseus. What happened in the bunker, Bell? Bell, Perseus said something. What was it? Bell, the door. Go inside. What happened in the bunker, Bell? The United States and its allies slowly consume that which is dear to us. Our leaders continue to weaken under this threat. It is the moral duty of Perseus to act when they will not. Soon we will possess an American nuclear bomb. The key to unlocking their entire green light arsenal. Once we control the green light arsenal, we will detonate them all from the safety of Solovetsky. You gotta admit I'm surprised. I didn't think they'd recover so fast. We tried everything. Normal forms of interrogation won't work. Breaking a subject's will and erasing their mind is a difficult and painful process. That's 
a small price to pay. The CIA's mind control program has had a great deal of success with implanted memories. You want me to tell them about my time in Vietnam? Lastly, you'll need a command phrase to trigger the implanted memories. We have a job to do. We have a job to do. We have a job. Have a job. Have a job. You had to reach the Soviet bunker. It appears the subject's programming is beginning to take hold. We've got a job to do. We've known each other for years. Fought together, bled together, been through the hell of Vietnam together. We've got a job to do. And now the training's complete. We just need to give the subject a name.